Welcome to this channel. In today's video, I'm talking about working with the V command, the VI command or V, as um, depends on how you call it. The V is just or the VI is just a text editor used in Linux operating system. So it's one of the most common text editors used to write text in the Linux operating system. These are some of the commands um, we'll be using when working with the v VI um, editor. The first one is I, lowercase I, to insert a text, you use I, to call, to use double D, to paste, you use P, lowercase P, to undo, you use lowercase U, to exit a file, you use colon Q, exclamation mark, and to take the cursor to the beginning of the line, you use capital O, and to take it to the end of the line, you use the dollar sign. So, in this, um, tutorial I'll be touching so I'm working on some tags the first tag we have here is um, tag 0 tag 0 says you should navigate to the root directory and create a directory named 0x03 so to do this you quickly um, fire up your terminal you launch your terminal and then in your terminal you navigate to your root directory and um, you create the new directory so you make directory 0x03 underscore vi and you press enter once you do that that directory is created you list the content of your root directory and you see that this 0x03 has been created so that's how to you do um, your first tag that's tag 0 we go back to our tags tags 1 says you should um, what is the command to insert text? So to insert text before the cursor, write your answer into this directory. So this is the directory you need to write it. You have to navigate into your root directory, then into your 0x03 underscore vi directory that you just created. Then you create a file called inserting, and that's where you put the command to insert text. So to do this, we simply fire up our terminal. In our terminal, we navigate into we're already in the root directory so we navigate into the 0x03 underscore vi directory and you can see we're already inside that directory here and um, now you echo you echo i into inserting now why are we using i now you have to check the, the table i gave before that the command to insert a text is i and your tax your question is saying that you should write a command to insert a text you can see it inserts a text so the command is i and that's why i'm putting that i into the file inserting so you echo after the echo is the command to do that if you are confused about all this you can check my previous video on shell navigation so once you press enter you see that um, the file the echo creates the file and it puts i inside the file so you list the files that are inside this directory and you see that inserting has been created now to check the content of the file use cats inserting and once you press enter you see i is the content of the file inserting so that's all about the second the first tax tax um, tax one so we go to the next tax that's um tax two tax two says you should write the what is the command to delete delete and cut delete and cut the current line write the answer into this directory so we have to navigate to our root directory into the 0x03 underscore vi directory they will create a file called cutting that is inside the file we're going to put the command to delete and cut now you may be asking what is the command to delete and cut here we have a command to delete and cut and the command to delete and cut is lowercase double d so dd lowercase we use that to delete and cut so now we fire up our shell we navigate to our shell um, inside our shell okay let me see what is happening to my shell come to my shell again okay now in my shell so in the shell we want to create write the file to cut and that is um, dd so we plus echo because we're already inside the directory we want to do that i'll put dd and we echo that into the file called cutting we're told to create this file cutting so echo helps us to create that file cutting and put the 
the content so once you do that you list the content of this directory and you see cutting has been inserted the file cutting has been inserted yeah, it has been created rather inside this directory 0x03 now to see the content of cutting to be sure that we have the right command inside cutting you use the command cut cutting so make sure you spell it very well press enter you see we have dd inside the file cutting so we go to our next tag the tag says we should okay first is what is the command to paste the line so we want to write command to paste the line in the buffer so we should write the answer in this directory now we have to navigate into our roots into this directory then create a file called pasting and we put the command to paste now you're asking what is the command to paste the command to paste <laughs> is just this lowercase p so we now get back to our shell or we launch our shell once again and in our shell we just we're already inside the right directory so we just echo lowercase p into pasting just as the tax told us echo into pasting oh i forgot to put this so we put this um yeah into pasting and we press enter so we have pasting created already and we have the content below our case p we list the files that are inside this directory and we have pasting already added alongside others that we've created so to check the content of pasting all we need to do is just use cat cat pasting and you can see that we already have p inside pasting we already have p inside pasting so we go to our next tags our next tag tells us that we should okay it says what is the command to undo so now we are interested in doing the, undoing undoing what you just did so we have to put our answer in this directory and then um, you know we have to create a file undoing to put our answer there so just the same process you go back here you check the you check the uh, what is the command to undo the command to undo is just simply lowercase u and so with lowercase u you come back to your shell um you fire up your shell and you echo into your shell lowercase u and you put it in the file okay lowercase u and you push it into the file undoing undoing you press enter you check the files that have been created in this directory you can see undoing now exists there and to check the content you use cut undoing Doing, make sure you are the right spelling on doing press enter you can see we have view inside so that's how to solve these tags very easy just follow on and you get it so you can do you can check other commands that are used in vi i provided a few for us we have that for exiting we have that for beginning of the line putting the cursor at the beginning of the line and that's for putting the cursor at the end of the line so i'm sure this video was very useful to you kindly subscribe to this channel click on the bell notification to be notified whenever a new video is dropped click on the like button and share the video thank you